naman ikaw? Gusto mo ikaw magsalita? Ha? <laughs> hiya ikaw. Hiya, hiya ang baby ko. Yeah. <laughs> Sige lang. Continue lang ang vlog ni mami. Hmm? Hi guys. Uh, pasensya na. Ayaw niya kasing matulog sa kanyang swing. Gusto niya lang karga-karga ko siya. Masyado siyang clingy today. Minsan lang naman sila maging baby. So, pagbigyan na lang. So, again, my name is Michelle. Your first time mama. And this is Ethan Tyler, my baby. My three months old baby. And welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, Please click like and subscribe and hit that notification bell as well. Thank you! Since dito naman na ako nakatira sa UK, well, I have to follow their practices, especially ano yung mga exercises na dapat gawin and beneficial para sa newborn. Doon ko lang nalaman ang tummy time. Kasi tummy time hindi siya ganun ka well-known sa kapanahunan ko or sa kapanahunan ng nanay ko. <laughs> so, what is tummy time? Well, from the name itself, tummy, you put your baby on his tummy or on his stomach. Tummy time is the first exercise for the baby and the most important. Bakit? Malalaman nyo. Just continue watching the video and malalaman nyo bakit. It is a crucial exercise for your baby's motor, visual, and sensory development. You can begin tummy time as early as newborn or, you know, the day you arrived home from the hospital until throughout his first year. Pwede kang mag-start, you know, just for a few minutes, probably 30 seconds or up to one minute, you know, like his first tummy time. And then you can put him back on his uh, back. Like a total of 15 minutes in one day, build up nyo up to longer periods. As you progress, habang observe nyo na kaya na ni baby, so you can increase it to like 20 minutes or 30 minutes a day up to, you know, one hour. Kapag na-reach na niya ang 3 or 4 months old, pwede ng total of one hour per day tummy time. Kasi, syempre, makakaya na niya yan for a full 4-5 minute. Isang tummy time lang ganyan. Tummy time is really hard for the baby. They will not like it. Usually, they will just cry all throughout. So, but just be patient. So, ano ang benefits ng tummy time? Ow! What are you doing? You're pinching, mommy. I know you're strong. Well, it helps develop the core muscles of the baby's neck, the baby's shoulders, and his back as well. It also helps meet um, the developmental milestones of your baby, or at least easier for them to reach or accomplish the milestones. It also helps prevent early motor delays and conditions of your baby. So what are these conditions? Number one is flat head syndrome or what we call the positional plagiocephaly. I think sa kapanahunan ko, uso talaga ang magkaroon ng flat head sa mga bata or sa mga babies. I think I've got a flat head as well dito ata sa isang side. So ngayon, um, they've developed tummy time to help prevent um, forming, you know, flat head ng mga babies kasi um, isa daw yun sa cause ng um, SIDS or sudden infant death syndrome. Another is the twisted neck or what we call the positional torticollis. Parang nasa, parati lang silang nasa naka right facing or left facing all the time. Kahit kargahin mo sila left facing, ibaba mo sila left facing if it's like a severe torticollis kasi ma, ma ano na siya eh ma-affect na yung spine mo ata parang mag curvature na yung spine so kailangan na niya ng help or ng referral ng pediatric 
occupational therapist or physiotherapist. So remember, um, tummy time, do it several times a day during his waking hours, a few minutes at a time. It should be done um, with full supervision. Dapat nandiyan ka talaga every time you do tummy time with the baby. Huwag mo siyang iiwan mag-isa or na nakakulob. So remember, put your baby on his back when he's asleep and on his tummy during playtime. Ayan. Finally, nakatulog na rin siya. So there are five positions of tummy time. So, ito yung chest to chest. Usually, ginagawa ko lang talaga siya dito sa aking nursing chair. Or pwede mo siya gawin sa sofa. Or sa bed. So, at first, pwede with two or three pillows. Hindi ganun ka. Hirap sa kanya gawin ang tummy time. And then, as time goes by, pwede mo nang bawasan ng pillow hanggang flat ka na sa bed or sa sofa. Maka-work harder siya to pull his head up football hold. Pwede yung isang kamay mo, hawak mo yung chest niya. And yung isa naman, hawak-hawak mo yung hip niya. Basta make sure full support mo si baby. And wag siyang malayo sa'yo. Dapat malapit siya sa'yo. At least alam niya na safe siya and comfortable naman siya. Using your lap. So yan, yung chest niya. I-elevate mo yung isang leg mo. It's not that hard for him to um, do tummy time. It is. This is also known as, you know, like when you try to burp your baby after feed. Ito yung first time na ni tummy time ko si baby. Well, it's a bit late but still, for me, it's still the right time. Kasi, syempre, cesarean ako. And mahirap, <laughs> hirap maglakad. Ang nagbe-breastfeed din ako. Dede, tulog. So, yun lang yung life niya at the start. Medyo dito, medyo awake na siya, longer periods, like two or two and a half hours. So, I've decided to start his tummy time. Exactly four weeks old siya dito. Yung kanyang playmat gym, nilagay ko sa, sa table. And I think that's the best uh, time to do nappy time be, uh, during his nappy change. Ito yung first na as in fully na kakaya na niya ang kanyang head. And it took him longer na. Kaya shock na shock kami ni Andrew. And we recorded it. <laughs> Pero make sure to do tummy time. Maybe after half an hour of feeding your baby. At least hindi naman niya isuka lahat ako. You know, like, kakatapos mo lang i-feed siya and then tummy time agad, baka isuka niya lang lahat. Can the baby smile? Can the baby smile? Well, look, it's Mr. Slimy Frog. Slimy, Slimy Frog. Slimy, Mr. Slimy. Kisses. No, you don't like Mr. Slimy. Another position ng tummy time is using a bobby pillow. In my case, I'm using my nursing pillow. Firm kasi siya. So, make sure na firm yung pillow na um, gagamitan mo sa kanya. Or else, ma po flat lang siya dyan. Mas easier kasi yan for them. Um, less kasi yung gravity pull sa kanila. At least yan medyo upright na sila mismo. Diyan din, syempre nasa floor kami pero still with his boppy pillow. He's 10 weeks old there. Mas masaya na siya dyan. 
And again, longer na rin yung uh, session niya ng tummy time dyan. Make sure din um, naka-position properly si baby while doing tummy time. Dapat yung elbows niya should be um, tucked in inside. So, dapat nakaganyan siya. Nakaganyan siya. Uh, anyway, nakaganyan naman siya. Dyan. Tuck in siya dapat sa loob. Kasi mahirap naman pag nakalabas siya, mahirapan siyang mag-push up. Push niya yung self niya pataas. So, make sure itatuck in mo pa loob. You can put a mirror in front of him. Gustong gusto nila yung may nakikita silang mukha. Kay Ethan, what I put in front of him is, you know, yung cell phone or iPad. So, at least nakikita niya yung self niya. May nakikita siyang mukha and masaya siya and naaliw siya. Who's that? Who is that little boy? Huh? Can you see him? Can you see him? No! Such a cute baby! Isn't he a cute baby? Yeah. Come on. Follow. Oh, he's so cute. He's such a cute, isn't he? Yeah. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Turn on your left. Turn on your left. Oh, it's like... Hello, baby. Hello. Hello, little boy. Ethan, why are you doing that? Come on, come on. Move on the other side. Yes. Yes, oh, good boy. Oh, oh my God. Excuse me. Excuse you. Pardon me. Pardon you. Pardon you. Oi, no, 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 no. Not tired now? Tired? Is he a tired boy? Good job. Oh my God, I'm so proud of my little boy. Para ma-entertain naman si baby, you can put a toy in front of them. You know, para hindi naman siya like in one position lang nakatingin. So, pwede nyo siyang i-move yung, pwede nyo i-move yung toy in front of him, left to right. Not just a toy, pero at least something, uh, you know, like a book or something that would catch his attention. Ito, 3 months old, so kayang-kaya na niya ang ulo niya. Stronger muscles on his neck and his shoulders. Tsaka sa back niya rin. Kaya na niya, I think, 5? Five, 5 minutes? Kung happy siya. <laughs> Pero pag fuzzy baby, then wala. Walang, wala tayong mapapala. <laughs> Kausapin mo si baby. Wow, you know, gusto, gusto din nila yan. May marinig sila. Very and good. always, always praise him for doing a great job. Kasi it's really hard, hard exercise for them. Give him a pat on the back, sa boom boom niya, or yes, clap your hands, yeah, para naman matuwa siya. Para alam niya na yeah. it's an activity that is very rewarding for us and for him. Also, give lots of kisses, loads, loads of kisses. So kapag ganyan, put him back on his back. Soothe him, and then pag medyo happy na siya ulit, try mo ilagay sa kanyang tummy time. Sometimes it works, happy siya ulit, and then sometimes it doesn't. Be patient. So sometimes, syempre, pagod siya. Pag pagod na siya, yan, higa na lang. Don'ts naman ng tummy time, don't do it at night time, don't do it unsupervised, always, always make sure na nandyan ka. 
and that's all for today thank you so much guys for watching if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel please click like and subscribe and that notification as well don't forget always always do tummy time only at daytime daytime and not night time because night time is sleeping time now for the babies thank you so much for watching see ya was that a nice experience yeah it is it is a nice experience it is it is yay <laughs> not happy baby